What's up guys? So it's been a very long week of not being able to play Warzone due to the errors that I've been getting ever since the last big update that they ran five days ago. And so many of you have been having the same issues. I'm hoping I finally found a fix for it. I know this one worked for me and nothing else that I've read on any of the forums has helped. If this does help you, do me a favor, make sure to like this video so we can push it out to more people. Also subscribe if you haven't done so. I'm going to do a quick walkthrough. I'm not going to edit this much or anything like that. So let me know in the comments if this did help you. All right, guys. So the very first thing I did was Battle.net. You know, you can right click on any program. And when you do so, you can run it as administrator. And sometimes that'll fix things. One thing I did not realize is you can go into properties and then go to compatibility. And then right here where it says change settings for all users, click that. And you can check the box to run this program as an administrator and just hit OK and OK that will actually run it as an administrator every single time you open it you don't have to right click on it and then approve it and so on and so forth so i'll move that out of the way so the only other thing that i did and i had tried this after looking at multiple other forums like the blizzard forum and the activision forum everybody was saying move this file move that file run it as an ad admin blah 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 none of that stuff worked for me one thing that oop, i'm on america's let's change that back or I was on Asia. Let's change that to Americas. Anyway, where it's where everyone was saying go to show and explore. I had this on my desktop, which is where I have Black Ops, Cold War, and Vanguard, and I had it on here. They were always saying create a new folder, move it into that folder, and you'll be fine. But no one ever said change where it was in its root. So what I did was went over to my documents created a new folder and I saw another video some guy said move it into another folder on your desktop or wherever you have it saved and he labeled it Warzone is broken so I did the same thing and that did not work for me until I moved it into documents so I created a new folder here in documents and then I just went into where it was on my desktop before I went in there and cut it and then pasted it into this folder in my documents all the, everything over here is you know just like it was when it was on my desktop all i did was move it to documents so once i did that i saved it or it automatically saved but i closed that out reopened blizzard and you will have to go in and go to uh right here it'll say locate folder what well, it'll say install instead of play so instead of hitting install, you're going to hit locate and folder and then just go to your new folder where you put it in documents. Locate that. Once you see the Warzone folder, hit it, select that folder. It'll allow you to play. And then when you click play, and obviously this is going to take a minute to come up, so I'll come right back as soon as it loads. And I, as this is loading in, I couldn't even get to this before it did the update or after I couldn't even get to this after it ran the update now so installing shaders it'll pop up in just a second and your game should be fixed if this worked for you please let me know in the comments below let me know all the other fixes that you tried before this also subscribe if you're new here and you want to find your way back and like the video so we can get this out to as many people as as we can because I know myself I looked for five days trying to figure out how to get back on Warzone and have not been able to play it and nobody else had this out yet so or I couldn't find the information anywhere so again hope this helped you talk to you soon